guys, this is Sauce and the Andre Boys. Today we're reviewing the Victus Vibe. The shell of this bat has originated from older Moochie models, and this thing is $200, so it's a great budget bat. And also, we have a special guest today. We have... What's up, guys? I'm Tyson Brown. I play with Prime, Pottstown, and SBA, and just here to have fun tonight. You ready to hit some bombs? Speaking of bombs, you remember that home run I hit off you? Yeah. <laughs> Remember the home run I hit off of you? Yeah. Hey. Hey. Woo! Hey. Woo! We're even now. Maybe we'll see each other again in the future. I mean, we do have some competition between each other, but today we're reviewing this bat and we're gonna see what this thing's got. So let's go. Let's go. This bat is literally the drip stick. Look at this thing. I like the vibe. Hey, Big Dish, check out my vibe. <laughs> this bat is a vibe. Thank you, Big Dish. Victus, I like the vibe, but the ball did. Oh, yeah. Hey, you got all of that one. Oh, yeah. All right, so me and Tyson both swung with the Victus vibe, and my thoughts were for a two hundred dollar budget bat, this is great. Um, for one piece, especially for kids that can't quite compress the composite, it is great. I think Victus really knocked that out of the park with this one. The only thing for me personally is that it was a bit light because I usually swing heavier composites. But other than that, I think this bat is great. Tyson. So me, I prefer LA bats. I, I swing on them in game. I like the feel of them. I like the durability of them, and they're just overall good bats. And uh. Victus, I'm feeling your vibe. If you're feeling my vibe, make a two-piece. Thank you for hitting with us, Tyson. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, make sure y'all like and subscribe. Do yes, it. Yes, sir. Do it now. Kobe. Yeah. Click the link in description to catch a vibe.